What is it like to play here at this, uh, you know, goth festival? Well, uh, we've, we've been partaking in the festivals, the goth festivals, for a few years. So, uh -huh. uh, I guess this, this is the first time we've been in Poland, though. Oh, yeah? Yeah, we've played at a couple of castles, uh, a few in Germany. Uh, but, yeah, this was a new adventure for us. And, you know, how was Poland you know, playing at this festival different than any other festival? The sun. Oh, what do you mean by that? <laughs> we were in it. Oh, yeah? We were yeah? discussing. We've never played like with the sun beating directly on us like that. Uh, that was pretty intense. Oh, brutal, huh? <laughs> <laughs> this kills the skin. <laughs> What do you think dress means to you know any kind of a festival like this here in Poland? Does it have any real relation with music or? I think it's connected to it. This scene definitely has a uniform. You come into town mm -hmm. and you see that the whole town is overflowing with people in black clothes. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, that's a pretty amazing sight. It's and pretty unique to the Gothic scene. Uh -huh. Yeah. Just to see the town overrun with people all in black clothes, it's quite a sight. Yeah. This is a Suzuki Omnicord. They, uh, Suzuki made these back in the 80s. Fire it up. Teach me so how to play this bad boy. I don't want to press some buttons. Yeah, come on. Yeah. So basically, you've got major, minor, and seventh. Uh -huh. It's pretty simple, so... So you can do anything you want. And this is an oh, auto... Oh, wow! It, what? This Yo. is an auto harp. Do it, Nate. Uh, uh. This is so dope, man. Look at this. Uh, I really uh, appreciate you guys taking the time out of your busy schedule to talk with us. Yep. You know, appreciate it. Oh, oh way you go. Thanks, Nate. <laughs> All right, brother. Really appreciate it, guys. For real. Real talk. You good luck with you.